Hi you guys, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Alana, and we're watching some Bleach today. All right, so from what I recall, Yuapaha has totally devoured the Soul King and now he's awakening, right? So I was thinking hopefully we'll get, you know, our people together because everybody is rounding together. We have those who are left behind by Yuapaha and the Soul Reapers are joining forces because they have a common denominator. Yuapaha needs to go down. Um, so, I mean, yeah, the Stern Raiders that he once had under him, whom he kind of like just lay by the wayside, they got some beef. So, of course, we have beef, so they are aligning with one another. But it seems as though it ain't looking too good for us. It's not looking too good for us at all. But positive note is Ichigo is fine. We have Yoruichi, fine. She was healed by Urihime. So it's like, I feel like we okay somewhat, but I'm still terrified of Yuapaha since he has totally devoured the Soul King. So yeah, this is, this is gonna be an interesting episode. <laughs> it's gonna be very interesting. So yeah, I'm gonna be quiet and let's go ahead and jump in. Let's go. Yo, that is the most ugliest and weirdest thing to look at. What in the world? You are Baha. Also, when is Grimjaw gonna come in here and uh, shake the table? Yeah, and he's tear apart and he's tearing apart everything. Mm. Will they be able to do it? Find out in the next episode. <laughs> No, he instantly knew who it was. He felt his presence. The music in the background for him is fitting. Look at them complimenting each other. Ah, 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 ah. This is not it, sir. <laughs> She's a grown woman, just threw herself at him. Look at her! She is blushing! Like, what are you doing? Really? Really? <laughs> Ooh! Big balls! Big balls! Number six, like you. She pulling the numbers on him. Huh? Everything. That's a lot. Oh, heavens. He put this into a video game setting. Easy. Smart. <laughs> he said, get it right. It looks like he has a PSP in his hand, doesn't it? So we have them creating this, what, easy access without using their spiritual pressure, and then we have them making this gate. Oh, she's telling her to stay positive. And that's an amplifier? 
I will say, even though Mayuri caused Uryu's family's, you know, death and stuff like that, and the rest of the Quincy's death, um, he, he does be on it when it comes to, like, the gadgets and stuff. Ah. Nice. Surprise attack, baby. Hopefully what happened last time don't happen again. Ooh. That's where he is. That's where he lives. <laughs> okay, sure. I want to believe that Uryu isn't totally bad still. I feel so like weird thinking that he can possibly be okay. Okay. <laughs> By looking like a monster? Wow, he stopped with it time and space? Like, just nothing's moving. Man, he is a booty licker. That is creepy. The hell? Oh, he made the Quincy sign. If you're really enjoying this reaction and want to see the full uncut version, please join me over on Patreon. There you'll have access to all the shows you see here on YouTube and the Patreon exclusives. And don't forget before you leave to comment, like, and subscribe. He said, I'm staying here. Chad. Chad. I'm saying right here. Oh, he's putting his faith in you. He said, you ain't telling me anything. I said what I said. <laughs> Ichiko is so sweet, and he gave her the cute face. And he's giving her an, a different purpose. Cute pout. Oh, okay. Oh. Is everybody arriving at the same time? Man, he talking too slow for me. Let's go. Dang, girls caked up! <laughs> Whoa, no! Her stick is there. The royal palace is gone. He has that power, that's why. Basically. If it's right in front of your face, I think it is happening. They're there. <laughs> Oh, 
They can't. They won't be able to get footing themselves. Dang. This is not good for the Soul Reapers. So what, they're going to be fighting just using their base, like, forms? Then we need to defeat the enemy and decide on a new Soul King. Who's going to replace? I think I had mentioned this before. Who will be the replacement? And so he's calm, cool, and collected, because I'll be freaking the fudge out. Oh, he's still building. He built a castle. Duh, they got the upper hand. That's why they got all the nerves. Well. I am very anxious to see how they're going to defeat him. I don't even know what to say at this point. <laughs> how are they going to even defeat this man? This man has tore down where the royal palace was. All that. All that. Rebuilt his own fucking city in such a short amount of time. And they're not able to use the Reishi like they want to because guess what? They're in control of it. So <laughs> let's see how this works. The blade burns away the field. Revealing my hidden friend. This is so like cryptic and I don't know what the heck they're referring to. <laughs> Okie dokie artichoke, that is this week's episode of Bleach. And like I said before, it's like, we are not in a good position. You know what I'm saying? Yes, we got the gate open. Yes, we understand like, hey, um, Yoruichi is here. We have the Gargantua, Gargantua, whatever it is. And then we have um, that, that space they were talking about to where they can kind of like move and to and from, you know, to and fro from, right? Cool. But when we get to said destination, which is the Royal Palace, where Yoruji has stuck this thing on nail, right? How, how are we gonna use our pals, eh? When they control all the reishi here, they're not allowing us. And on top of that, you know what I'm saying? They are baiting them in just like, come fight me, come, come, come get me. And then we have this one dude, the booty licker. He's talking about, huh, okay, we're gonna just kill them all. Let's kill them all. How are we gonna fight them, man, how? 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 I don't know. Yuabaha is the man right now, and he knows it. We know it. So how are they, how are they gonna do this? It was good though to see Grim Jow, um, Nell, and the rest of these guys though coming in to help us. I know Grim Jow's like, hey, if he takes down Wakamundo, then I won't be able to, you know, kill you. You know what I mean? But in the midst of all of that, it's cute, but how is Yuabaha gonna go down? Especially with the fact that he knows what's gonna happen. Hmm. He now he has foresight, right? And now he has all this power. I, mm -mm. I don't know, y'all. I do not know. I do not know. But we shall see. But yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode with me, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.